It's Tony time, according to Fitness Girls magazine, because Tony Storm, the hypocritical, the money hungry, AEW's Tony Storm has been posing in her birthday suit. She has been posing naked for the front cover of the Fitness Girls magazine. And you might be thinking, well, what's the problem with that? What's the big deal about it? Because it has brought up some controversial issues. And a lot of people have been going back to the time before she left WWE with the fact that she didn't want to be in a scene, in a segment where Charlotte Flair ripped her top off and she was going to be revealed left to be standing in her bra. Now, Tony Storm at the time had a big issue with this. She said it was degrading to women. She said she'd feel uncomfortable. She said she didn't want to do it. She didn't mind getting pie in her face, and I'm sure that's not the only thing she takes in the face, but she says that she did not feel comfortable being, you know, on TV uh, or just being there in her bra in front of other people being on screen. However, you know, she is more than happy to pose naked to be in the front cover of a magazine. Now, yes, you could say she is covering her up, you know, the, the real private parts. So she's got her arms over her boobs and her legs are crossed. So you, you aren't really seeing, you know, you aren't, you aren't seeing any of the private parts. But then again, you wouldn't have seen any of them on SmackDown either. Plus, not only that, shortly after leaving the WWE, Tony Storm actually created an OnlyFans account where she was charging, I believe, $39.99 per month. And she was at least, I don't know exactly what was on it, but she was at least posting photos and videos in her bra and panties. So again, it takes us back to the old SmackDown thing where she says it was degrading and that she wouldn't feel comfortable. Now, a lot of white knights, you know, a lot of the, you know, the, the wrestling fanboys have been defending this, saying that the two things are not the same and that she is perfectly, you know, justified in feeling one way about the SmackDown thing and then feeling another way about, you know, her OnlyFans or magazine cover, you know, um, actions but th th they are essentially the same the only difference is she was getting paid she's getting paid directly for the magazine cover she's getting paid directly for only fans so you know it's not like tony storm is this like woman that she considers herself pure and that she doesn't want to be seen like undressed or she doesn't want to be seen in revealing outfits like molly holly let's get that straight here tony storm is not a fucking molly holly i didn't see molly holly refusing to take part in brand panty matches ju just so she could go and pose in playboy or just so she could go and you know fucking do porn because that never happened we never seen that with molly Holly because she legit did not want to be undressed and that's perfectly okay that's fine but Tony Storm is a hypocrite she's a liar she says that she would feel degraded and that her being shown on TV and her bra would be degrading it's not degrading it's just she wants it money for it you know she wants the only fans because she gets the money she wants the magazine covers because she gets the money but what she isn't taking into account is she was getting paid a salary by the WWE. Now, I'm not hating on her. I mean, hot women want to be naked. I'm not going to complain at all. But I don't like hypocrites. And that's exactly what Tony Storm is, in my opinion. So, yeah, guys, that's got a date there. Just I thought it was an interesting video that she was posting naked here in this magazine. Yet she was pretty much refusing to be, you know, shown in her bra because she said it was degrading. Yet when the money's right, she's happy to do it. So it's not about being degraded. It's about getting paid. So, uh, yeah, Tony Storm needs to get that right. And anyway, who gives a shit about Tony Storm? What is she doing in AEW at the moment? Absolutely nothing. Why? Because AEW sucks and Tony Storm sucks. Anyway, guys, that's it. Catch you in the next one. Been Fog Wrestling. We'll see you later. Peace.